Ron is the worst student. He does not do his homework. Instead, he plays video games. His teacher yells at him. Ron does not care. He listens to music when the teacher is talking. He does not study. His test scores are bad.
He is mean to his classmates too. Chuck asks to borrow his eraser. Ron hits him. Chris wants a pet. He likes fish. Fish are easy to take care of. Fish are pretty. Chris thinks he is responsible enough too.
He decides to go to the pet store himself. He buys a fish. It is small. It is red and black. It swims slowly. Chris puts it in a tank. Her dad is lonely. He lives in a big house with no one. He is divorced. His friends live far away.
He does not work anymore. He just sits at home and watches movies. She feels bad for her dad. She surprises him with a dog. He loves the dog so much. He takes care of it. A glass of milk is on the desk. It is near the edge.
The child looks at the milk. The child wants to drink it. The cat looks at the milk. The cat wants to drink it too. They both walk towards the desk. The cat is faster. It jumps on the desk. The glass of milk tips over.
The milk is all over the floor. It is the first day of high school. She is completely lost. She has never been here before. Her first class is Spanish. The classes in the A building. A staff member sees her wandering around.
He gives her a map. She looks at it. She finds her Spanish class. He waits for his package. He is excited. He will finally get a shirt today. He waits outside his house. The mail carrier gives him the package. He opens it.
The shirt is red. He ordered the blue one. He is upset. He calls the company. The manager apologizes. He will send the blue shirt for free. She goes to English class. She reaches into her backpack. Her glasses are not inside.
She cannot see anything. Her teacher writes the sentence the cat chases the ball. The teacher asks the students to copy this sentence. She squints. She still cannot see the sentence. She sits closer to the board. She will never forget her glasses again.
He reads a book. The main character is a wolf. It tries to find its family. It travels all over the world. In the end, the wolf dies. This book is too sad. He reads another one. The main character is a girl.
She wants to win a swimming competition. She practices a lot. In the end, she gets first place. He likes this book. She has a lot of pants. She has two pairs of jeans. One of them is light blue. The other one is navy blue.
She has two pairs of formal pants. One of them is khaki. The other one is gray. She has two pairs of casual pants. One of them has flowers on it. The other one has hearts on it. She wears pants every day. He goes outside. He 
He sees a ladybug. The ladybug is red. It has black spots too. It has six legs. It has two wings. It is small. He puts the ladybug on his finger. It tickles. The ladybug crawls all over him. He wants to keep it.
The ladybug flies away. He tries to catch it. She likes to pretend she is a doctor for fun. She wears a white coat. She pretends her room is a medical office. Her dad pretends he is a patient. Her dad goes into her room.
He tells her how he is feeling. He says that he keeps coughing. She tells him to drink a lot of water. The teacher announces that there is a test. The students clear off their desks. The teacher passes out the tests. A student takes a deep breath.
He takes out his pencil. He looks at the questions. He knows the answers. He writes them down. He finishes the test. He feels good. The boy tries to study for his quiz tomorrow. His cat keeps bothering him. It keeps pulling his leg.
It keeps making noises. He gets a ball of yarn. He throws it across the room. The cat chases the ball of yarn. The cat catches the yarn. It plays with it. The boy can finally study. Tag is a very fun game.
George, Lisa, and Laura play tag every day. Lisa and Laura run around. George tries to chase them. He runs as fast as he can. He decides to find Lisa. She is a slow runner. He sees her running. He catches up to her. He taps her on the shoulder.
He says to her, Tag, you are it. The boy is always busy. He goes to school for eight hours. He has seven classes. They are all hard. He has a lot of homework. It takes him five hours to finish it. He also has piano practice.
he spends two hours playing the piano. He only sleeps for four hours. He is tired. Mike and his grandmother go to the park's playground. There are so many things to do. Mike runs over to the swing set. He sits on a swing. He kicks the ground.
His legs are in the air. His grandmother pushes him. He is even higher. He feels like he can touch the sky. It is a sunny day. She feels hot. She fans herself with a book. It is still hot. She turns on the air conditioner.
It is still hot. She jumps into a pool. It is still hot. Her dad has an idea. He takes her to the ice cream shop. They share a banana split. She does not feel hot anymore. He pours a glass of soda for himself. Thank you.
he accidentally spills some on his shirt. Oh no. His mom will get mad. His shirt is very expensive. He tries to clean it up. He pours water on it. He uses a stain remover. He takes the shirt to a dry cleaner's. Nothing works. Thank you. 
A Ferris wheel is a huge rotating wheel. It has many seats. He sits on one of them. His seat is yellow. He is excited. He puts his seatbelt on. He holds on to the metal bar. He wants to be safe. The wheel moves. He starts to go up higher and higher.
He looks down. The people are so small. The view is so nice. The boy waits for the mailman. A package is supposed to come today. He sits by the window. He sees the mailman walking. He goes outside.
He says hello to the mailman. The mailman gives him the package. They say goodbye to each other. The boy goes back to his house. John wants to go to a school field trip. He needs $50. He wants to earn it himself.
He plans to open up a lemonade stand. He goes to the market. The lemons are cheap. They are also ripe. He buys 50 lemons. He starts making lemonade. A lot of people are in line. His lemonade stand is a success. He makes enough money.
She eats a slice of cake. She drops a crumb. The ants can smell it. They crawl towards the crumb. She notices the ants. She does not want to kill them. She gets a cup. She puts the ants inside. She opens the window.
She lets the ants go. Tomorrow is the first day of school. Patty looks at her backpack. It has holes. It is dirty. She needs a new one. Her mom takes her shopping. There are so many backpacks. One backpack has yellow stars.
Another one has rainbow stripes. Another one has dogs. likes this one. She buys it.